Hello, in this video, you'll learn how to navigate around the Asset Manager. You'll learn how to customize your views, organize your assets, and much more. You can find the Asset Manager here in Sprinkler Social under Digital Asset Management. Right away at the top of the screen, you'll see a number of buttons allowing you to control your view. First, we can choose between Grid View and List View here. And while in Grid View, you can set how large your assets appear from small to large. This will help you to customize the look and feel of your Asset Manager and these settings will be saved, so when you come back in the future, the asset cards will be the same size as before. You can also set which properties are visible on the cards by clicking the Options menu here, then toggling your preferred properties on and off from this list. The chosen properties will then appear under the preview of the asset here. If we then switch to List View, you'll have a similar option here whereby you can set which columns are visible in the list. Simply make your choices and click Apply. Lastly, from either list or grid view, you're able to select multiple assets at once by clicking on them. At the bottom of the page, you'll then see several options for bulk actions like sharing, downloading, and many more in the options menu here. At the top of the asset manager, you'll see the search field where you can type in your queries. You can search by title, description, or any other relevant metadata. We also have further advanced search capabilities available, and to find out more about this, please get in touch with your success manager. Just below the search field, you'll find a standard set of filters. You can filter by campaign type, or by clicking Add Filter, you can choose a new filter. Once you've applied your filters, you can save them as a new board here, so you don't have to reapply them each time you load up the Asset Manager. Next, you can choose how you sort the assets by clicking here. You can choose from any of these date options, or you can sort by name. And just to the right here, you can set the sort to be ascending or descending. If you'd like further information on organizing your assets, you can check out the Knowledge Portal. To find it, click your user icon in the top right, choose Platform Help, and then Knowledge Portal. From here, you can use the search bar to find the information you're looking for. In this video, you've learned how to organize your assets and navigate your way around the Asset Manager. Thanks for watching.